underneath the neck and it's going to be tucked under your right arm. You can just bring it up so it's parallel to the ground and also a right passe parallel so it's not turned out and you're facing the left end of them. One, two, three, four. Flourish five, six, seven, eight um, with the free hand. Five, six, seven, eight. Then up to right shoulder kind of, nine, ten. Right flat, eleven, twelve. Now I'm going to do like a thumb roll, kind of on the 45, 13, 14, 15, 16. So now I'm at a low V. Next, I bring it up kind of to a baseball bat angle. I want it to be parallel to the ground. One, two, flip it, three, four. So your body moves, but not your rifle, it stays. Now you just uh, do a loop, five, six, seven, eight, to kind of flat. Make sure that your left hand grabs under where it would be for a regular left flat. Because next, your right hand's gonna move to the butt for a real left flat, and you're gonna bring it up and dip with a saute on your left foot, 9, 10, 11, 12. Make sure that you look up to the sky on 9, 10, 9, 10, 11, 12. And on 13, you're gonna toss. I'm thinking maybe a double. Um, if only part of the guard will do it, hopefully they can do a double then. And toss on 13, 13, 14, 15, 16. I think that I want to have it add on. So every eight counts, a new group starts, maybe three girls at a time. And you can start with the beginners, because they can do this stuff. Okay, so then another group adds on. Uh, this might be moving, you might have feet, you might be moving. Um, they can do this. And then the last group to add on would be like your four best rifles. And they would add on, and maybe only they could do this toss, the others don't have to. And then you remain with like your four best or however many that can you really do the rifle in the front. The others have continued to back up on the add-on and now they can leave to another drill something. And then the front people will do the spin. These are spins in half time so that I push on one, one, two, three, four, five. So it's just two drop spins and I'm taking five counts to do it. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Um, let's see. Spin, spin up the second spin. I basically do a single. And then I catch it again. So it's spin, spin, single. All in your right hand. Spin, spin, single, catch. From there I immediately go into a butterfly. And then I come back to do, oh, the counts for that is 9, 10, 11, 12. I do a, what do we call it, angel wings, 13, 14, 15, 16, should be grabbing on 15, 16 above your head. Continue out with your left hand, oh, this is pinky to pinky, okay? Continue out with your left hand around, over your toes, and we're gonna do a little baby flip. It just goes right with the momentum into a flip and catch it right hand at the neck. So all together that part is spin, spin, single, catch, butterfly, angel wings, around, and flip. And so the flip happens on one, two, three, four. Continue at five, six, seven, eight to flat at your shoulder. This is prep for a horizontal toss. Release on nine, it just goes a little tiny bit. I'll step back so you can see it for sure. Okay. That's it. So then I catch it, my right hand's at the neck and my left hand's above where the bolt is. Okay, or the hardware. So from here, it's just a little tiny, tiny hop. I catch it, bring it down, slide your hand, and jump turn over your left shoulder, bring it up to flat like above your head in the air. Then everyone can add back in to do all this work again, and hopefully we're holding still for it so we can do our footwork. We're gonna do kind of what we did last year uh, with some of Mary Poppins, and you take it, I'm gonna switch my hand under, so I'm grabbing both my hands, I'm gonna kinda tick tock it to the side, Step back with my left foot, chasse, and the loop. Then, um, this is where it'll change a little bit. I'm going to take it over my right shoulder. So I go tick tock, loop, and like a, a backwards rowboat, okay? Keep it in the toaster so that it goes around here, and then it's going to come back to the front. Um, all together, we're here, chasse, here. Up again this way, all in the toaster. A uh, slow motion, we have the um, strap
step is leading and then it flips to go around. I'm going to let go with both my hands at the same time and then grab with my right hand at the neck with the barrel pointing up. When I do that, my left hand kind of grabs, hooks my thumb and pulls down and then my right hand is releasing up. So I'm here, here, out. It's a little pop, there's not a lot of power to it. Um, it doesn't even go, I guess it's like one rotation. There, that's all it is. Then from here, I'm going to do um, a flourish. Regular, okay. Now I'm gonna kinda twist my shoulders to the end zone so I can do a loop with my right arm. That's in the toaster. And I'm gonna grab it backhand with my left hand and flourish out of that with the free hand all the way to the left flat. Um, but my right hand is gonna grab underneath as I catch that flourish. So it'll be like here to here. Catching it under. Now I'm gonna loop up through my arm. Okay, remember you kinda have to go up into like a lobster claw. Your hand kinda loosens and your arm straightens so that you don't hit yourself. So I'm here. Now I'm gonna do like a thumb roll so that when I come back down, my hand's on top. Now I can slide it as I turn over my right shoulder and this stays in the toaster. It's gonna go like flat, up, here, flat, around. Oh no, don't slide it, it stays at the neck. What am I thinking? So I'm turning in my toaster, then from here, um, scoop it. Think about making a big circle around, leading with the tip to circle around this way. Up on the 45, down on the 45, between your legs. I would like to see everyone do this, but they don't have to. This is just a single, it's on a 45 angle from under your leg, no big deal. From here, and catch it on the 45. Try to catch it and look at the audience. Right when that note's ending, it'll be a really good impact. Otherwise, the girls that can't do that toss, they can still do this turn, they can do all of that, and then they can go here, and um, maybe have their rifle down as they're leaving to set down to get the next equipment. Or, what else could they do? Oh, they can go down and then look up at the audience on the catch. That would be really cool if they couldn't get off the field. So, um, girls that toss, they go around. 45, around. Look. The other girls will do the 45. Look down, look on the catch. Okay? Then the girls that didn't toss, um, there are probably like three or four rifles left. Five, I don't know how many you'll have. Your best rifles will stay. The rest, like your flag line, they're going to leave and they're going to get one of our balls. Um, if we use that prop, they're going to get one of the balls. The rifles will stay on and so they'll catch this. They'll hold it for a count just for an effect. And then in the silence, which will probably be percussion. They're gonna cradle it so that we kind of keep the focus on the field real big. And then as the girls are entering with the balls, which are our stars, they're gonna kind of start motioning towards the stars. It's gonna be really dramatic. So we're gonna do a big chasse to our left shoulder and circle this right arm. It's gonna go clockwise here. My left arm's gonna come into my shoulder and out. Really, really dramatic. Okay, this one to be like an emotional moment for the audience. Then we're going to open up our arms. We're going to do a Shanae turn to our right. So we open together. Open. Oh. Lost my camera. There we go. I don't know when that fell. So I'm here. I'm dramatic. I open. Together. Open. And I'm going to, as I open up from that, I'm going to do a little rondage drum with my left foot. Maybe you can't see my feet. How horrible will that be? So I'm here, dramatic, open, other, open, and as I step this, this foot runs and knocks out, my rifle's going to circle the opposite way, okay, above me, to here. Now, the rifle's going to unwind behind my back and do like a little J-toss, catch it with one hand, just like we did with the flag in song one. When you catch it, you're going to do a fake out turn right next to your shoulder and in the toaster. And as you come around, then you're gonna grab it underneath like you're ready to do a toss. So I unwind it, let go, around, and I want you to get low so we have the power and weight account so that you're for sure prepped and ready. Then let's try for a double from this, okay? Just a regular, a regular toss, except your hand is gonna be pulling down with your thumb instead of pushing like that. So I'm here, I'm gonna do a double. And let's catch it and come up. And then I want to look over at 
then we'll kind of like present this to the stars, cradle it, and that's when we exit off and we'll be ready for tune quattro. So, right forward. Excellent. 